I travel the world looking for understanding of the times that we live in, hunting and gathering first-hand information, challenging definitions of sin. I travel the world looking for lovers of the ultimate beauty, but never. Welcome everybody to a beautiful SOMEONE ELSE IS CALLING ME! <laughs> You're recording, I didn't call you! <laughs> anyway, welcome back to Angels with Scaly Wings. Last time we... Hit me right in the feels with a sledgehammer. This time we're hopefully not going to get that fucking sad because we're going to be going and hanging out with the chief of police. So, I'm not alone this time. I'm actually streaming this while recording to two people who I'm talking to on Skype. Yay! This game doesn't decide to crash. <laughs> Wishful nah. thinking this game doesn't crash or something doesn't go horribly, horribly hey, hey. wrong. Knock on wood, man. It's because he's trying to jinx you. <laughs> Knock on wood, I'm not ready to punch myself in the dick. <laughs> you already got one, have you started? Continuing your story, Furry. Duty. Sebastian's cute face is how it all starts. That that's who I'm claiming as the culprit for everything. If it wasn't for Sebastian's cute, adorable, goddamn face, none of this would have happened. <laughs> He's so cute, I'm gonna die! <laughs> and again, we wake up. But we've seen it so many times, why is it unfamiliar? Come on, man, remember that. Remember the ceiling you always see. The door opens, and then, oh my god, it's the system! <laughs> I can't believe I didn't laugh at that before. <laughs> it's like, door opens, it's the system asking me if I want to skip! What is the system? Hello, person! <laughs> okay, now that I've, uh, now that I've changed my Skype status to do not disturb, maybe he can fuck right off! <laughs> Uh, no, uh, I kind of don't want to skip ahead, do I? Do I want to skip ahead? There's not really much you can do. The oh, oh, unless you're, oh, no, no, sorry. This is uh, one. You can choose some options here. But you're going for uh, Bryce, and let's see which ending you get. My vote is you're actually going to get his bad ending. My vote is I probably will. Unless you want me to kind of tell you when it happens to choose something. Uh, yeah, yeah, could you, could you please? I'm tired of getting bad endings all the time. So you want the good ending first? I want the good ending first for once. Okay. Uh, let's go ahead and skip then. I'm trusting you on this. <laughs> yes. Bryce led me back to the apartment. I guess there wasn't really much for me to do in the meantime, as I was spared the more arduous parts of the investigation. Maybe I should have been glad about this. Now I had an afternoon to fill. We could immediately turn around and go talk to Bryce again. <laughs> Let's go talk to him. <laughs> According to the fucking text, he just dropped us off at our house. We go inside, we turn around, walk back outside. Hey, Bryce, what? <laughs> oh, actually, no, 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 no. Uh... Let's start with Anna first. Because there's something that you can do with Anna. Wait, have you already? I can't remember if it's actually in that scene or not. It is, isn't it? What? In the scene that we just skipped, where you give her you give her your blood. Yep. Damn. I guess you have to actually choose that, I'm pretty sure. Oh. Well, <sighs> do you right. want to try doing that, or do you want to just Restart go ahead and continue? Because <laughs> I think... I don't think we have to, though. Okay, let's just go out. Let's do it. Oh, fuck it. <laughs> I'm sorry. 
Again, All right, no skipping. I can blame you for that. <laughs> All right, so no skipping. Uh, no, choose this, what you want with Sebastian. Be the this is going to be the most fucked up uh, path. No, it's not going to be that bad. I'm pretty sure it will be. Really? What do you think is going to happen? All right, I think so we're me not gonna... and the chief are gonna fall asleep drunk one night and wake up covered in semen. <laughs> <laughs> what did we do last night? Uh, apparently one of us either got off or we both did. My butt hurts. <laughs> my butt hurts. <laughs> also, also, my head hurts. Also, yeah, you were really fucking hammered. <laughs> <laughs> Very much so. Hmm. What do you mean I was hammered? In both meanings of the word. <laughs> your head's pounding now and your ass was being pounded then. <laughs> and I was met by another dragon. It's the system! Alright, alright. System, we will not skip. No, I want to meet Maverick and Dickhead and... Aw, oh, Sebastian's so cute! I just hug you now, Sebastian. It's like, how do you know my name? <laughs> I'll be your escort. Or uh, security. I'll be your escort. Or s security, I suppose. So, uh, you do escort service on Thanks the side? <laughs> <laughs> He's an escort on the side. When he, he somewhat him. nervously extended his arm. I'm just expecting, like, slowly reaching out and just, like, gazing at his hand and back up at me repeatedly, like, wondering if I know how to shake hands. <laughs> but can you imagine that that is probably the most awkward part of it all? Is that I... he's wondering if I know how to shake hands? Do humans even shake hands? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> like, the entire time he's reaching his hand, I'm like, oh, hopefully I don't offend them. Do you even shake, bro? <laughs> we don't shake. Just kiss it for the heck of it. Just to give him that blush. Given that he's been doing it constantly. <laughs> so you don't even know where I put my hands and you just kissed it? <laughs> and then he shrugs it off like nothing fucking happens. I also love how the text box, uh, I haven't pointed it out before, but I've noticed the whole time how the text box is actually looking like scales. Yeah. It's, it's a nice fucking touch. Instead of being so bland. It's got a texture to it. There's a dick and a dragon. <laughs> With bitch face syndrome. Both of them have bitch face syndrome. <laughs> In both different meanings of the word. <laughs> fucking Maverick just looks pissed off and Reza looks like a little bitch. So just like you then. <laughs> Go ahead. Just like you then. I don't fucking care what you Very think. funny. Hey, I'm trying to be funny. <laughs> nice to meet you. Yeah, whatever. Like, I'm nice and then he just acts like a dick to me. It's like, really? I'm doing something! And then, like, right here, Reza sticks up for you, but it's just like, yeah, you're not really doing that. You just don't like your dragon, dude. Yeah, he wants to find an excuse just to get angry at... Maverick. Poor Maverick. So yes, I am Faria, your host for this evening, and I've brought along some company. Which we haven't even done anything other than just say hello! <laughs> or, I don't even think I said hello! We have, uh, Hikari, right? Yes, that's that's my Hikari, name. Hikari, the, the master who who knows everything about this game. No, I wouldn't have made a mistake if I knew everything. <laughs> I know a lot, because I beat it. Nobody's played, perfect, even so. I played it for 44 hours. I wasted my life away just playing this. <laughs> and we have Lucian. Hello, Lucian! Lucian! Yes, hello. You're gonna die! 
Is that the response I really get? <laughs> Not you! I'm talking about Anna. No matter what I do, Anna, I couldn't save you. I'm doing something. I'll be back. And there goes, uh, Mr. Reza just taking the box and running like a little bitch. I'll take that! That's mine! <laughs> and that's mine, and that's mine? What are you, now, what are those seagulls? Mine, mine, sure, mine. Sure, sure. Take I have my blood, Anna. At I least don't mind keep you poking you busy me. until your final hours. Hey, I don't mind you poking me. Feel free to poke away, Anna. <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry, Anna. I'll poke you back sometime soon. <laughs> no. Sure. Go ahead. I don't care. <laughs> it doesn't matter. That's honestly the only time I feel Maverick was a nice person. This line right here. I wouldn't mind if Kevin liked myself. No, he just wants to follow. Skip! To investigation! Well, we want to talk to Maverick. We don't want to skip his part, at least. Let's just not skip everything! Oh, it's Anna! Oh, like, it's a dragon! <laughs> That's a good one! Oh, it's Anna? Why is it Anna? We just talked to Anna, and I'm calling Adine Anna. I'm sorry, Adine! I didn't mean to! Adine's the one person who does not deserve their life to get fucked up! I know, right? She's like She's the one that's trying to... <laughs> you know, right now, you just say you scramble the eggs, and she's taking care of eggs. <laughs> oh sure, let's just bring back the episode when Togepi was introduced. Can we scramble that? It hatches. Wait, it's alive! I'm gonna take just a coffee. Reza doesn't care what you choose, he just says me too, just make it quick. That's how well, boring yeah. he is. Let me grab my tinfoil hat real quick, Reza, you big <laughs> fucking pansy. <laughs> he doesn't seem so bad to me. In the whole, yeah, he's a charming fellow. That does seem to be one that could be kind of rude to say or nice, depending on how you say it. I think if I, I think it's the he well he's a charming fellow is the agreeing with Reza and being sarcastic. Yeah, that makes sense. No shoe scaly face no. You have to be nice to Adine. She hasn't done yeah. anything wrong to anybody. And quite frankly, she's just trying to get her way, make her way through life. Yeah, if, if I were there and, and everything that was being taken care of, all the money and whatnot, I would have done what Sebastian does. Like as as soon as you leave, he says that he, uh, she he left a sizable uh, donation in your in your stead. I would have done that anyways, because if if everything is being taken care of by the council, I'm like, why not give away the council's money for everyone I meet? <laughs> Here, you you deserve a donation. <laughs> I'd be going out to eat like pretty much twenty four seven and just leaving big tips. <laughs> Hello again, Adine. I was just here three hours ago. <laughs> I'll just have a coffee. Here's twenty bucks. Yeah, I'll have a coffee. Here, here's a here's three a, hours here's later. Five grand. Yeah, I was like five th three hours later. You come back for another coffee, but you're so awesome. I'm gonna give you five grand. Like, what? 
<laughs> Athene would probably flip her shit. And the council would probably be like, oh my gosh, what are you doing? It's like, <laughs> Stop what? it! Not stop spending our money! God damn, we didn't put any legally binding contract to make them stop! <laughs> Is this not normal in your in your culture to give uh, big tips for the really good uh, waitresses? <laughs> so much talking. <laughs> Spoilers for anyone who didn't see that scene. Uh, her mother's dead. <laughs> Wait, what? Vara. Oh. Yeah. You didn't... You forgot. I forgot. Gave her a generous tip on your behalf. How nice of you, Sebastian. Of course not, as long as I don't have to spend anything. <laughs> That's so rude. Uh, so you want to go in particular? Let me know, or I could show you around town. Yeah, I wish I could get shown around town. I know, right? Uh Such an awkward fucking picture of him. He looks a little sly right there. Yeah, he's like, hey, I'm gonna get my chance. <laughs> What's well, sort of what he's doing here, anyways? He's, I'm he's not trying signing to get his away my rights with, with this, you. right? My Lorem's not that sneaky. He's just being the post boy, trying to. Talk with a human that he's so fascinated with, as with every other dragon that is not, or that is into the whole lore. <laughs> and trying to make a video game. <laughs> oh, yeah. Like, to be honest, like, as soon as Lorem would have given me the fucking letter, I'd be like, Sebastian, kick him out. <laughs> really? <laughs> he's cute. <laughs> he, he's he's alright, I guess. I just don't really like him. Aww. I find him kind of annoying. <laughs> He's artsy. Artsy. Yeah, he likes to draw. Well, f drawing characters for his game, that is, at least. You got what you wanted. Off you go now. I'm Have sorry, but Lorem, on your way out, you accidentally dropped something on the E-key. <laughs> it's just so much easier just to press Enter than Control-A-Delete. Are you sure that's Reza that wrote that? I think I know its so meaning. Like <laughs> Are you gonna do that again? He wanted me to flee through the portal! No, that's not it. Fine. Fuck you too. Oh, oh, no, no. Don't go to, don't go to the kitchen. Go to the bathroom first. Just for the heck of it. I already Just, looked through everything. Oh. Cabinet? Cabinet twice. Or take the meds twice. <laughs> Just do it! <laughs> now you're becoming Shia LaBeouf. <laughs> it's not gonna kill you. Pain meds. Okay, whatever. Pain meds! Straight. Okay, one more time. Never mind, I've it three times. Not twice. Take it until it stops! Can't hurt because they're pain meds. <laughs> Blackout! That 
was totally a smart move because achievement. <laughs> you should probably know it was a bad idea. Prescription. What's in the shower? <laughs> Damn. No shampoo. Just body wash. Uh, the bookshelf. Come back. Come back. Okay, fine. Drink the mystery liquid. Nope, that's just an egg. What about this egg? No, nope, it's just an owl. This it's egg? There's gotta be one. There's gotta be a false egg here somewhere. I'm gonna tear this fucking place inside out trying to find it. It's an unborn chicken! There we go. <laughs> Poor egg. Overside. Here goes Melvin. It's salty. Okay, go back. Uh, <laughs> Wait, did you already go over all the uh, veggies in the pantry? Or the fruits and whatever in the pantry? Bookshelf! Look behind the books! Individual books first. Okay, fine. This one's gonna take some time, so you can probably mash the uh, space key or something. Born to serve. Now, you don't have to do all of these, but go ahead and do the second to last one. Or the last, yeah, that one. The right Ximin Spear and how to use it, yeah, I have a feeling that's gonna tie in with Lorem. Well, you don't even have to do that during Lorem's. This just gives you a, a, an idea of what's going on. So, on a flat, stable surface, okay. <laughs> Household is that? So it's gotta plug in somewhere. Yay! Yeah. That'll, that will tie Question into the prayer. other so. Because you were asked to read it. Yeah. The rest of it doesn't matter anymore. Look behind the box. <laughs> Just because. Oh look, dust! Bunnies! What are you doing? Are you not watching and contributing to Let's what's see. going on? To the kitchen! The pantry. What? You, you already went through those, haven't you? Or no? Because you if went I put on the floor and stuff on it, what would happen? I'd be going on a date. But no, there's no hint here. A fig! Figuratively speaking. Pair. There's two of them. What a nice pair. See, this is the corny jokes here. I just face palmed. <laughs> this is the corny jokes. Great. Stop whining. Fire in my ass. It's called. It's a joke to do with your weapon, sir. It's called comedy. And I'm not any good at it when I'm ill. Hey, achievement. We've gotten three achievements just inside the house. You could have gotten four if you didn't already get the mystery liquid. <laughs> what are you doing? Just gonna pass all of the shit that I can. But there's no more. I know, but I'm just gonna make sure I leave nothing to nothing open. Okay. Wouldn't it be fucking amazing to just just what? Like be able to just skip meeting him at the portal, and he just goes fucking home. <laughs> You just choose to go home, and then it, it gives you the end of, like, I, I, I give up. Yeah. <laughs> Another achievement! achievement. I give up. <laughs> wow. Achievement Burn. Hunter! <laughs> okay, fine. Okay, fine. Yeah. 
I didn't want to be a bookworm. Why'd you have to be a bookworm? Because <laughs> you had a feeling that was actually an achievement, didn't you? Pretty much. Aww. <laughs> I couldn't take you away from it! Blah, blah, blah. What'd what, you expect? What'd you expect? Shoot right here. Wonderful, wonderful night it is. Josh, spit it out already, you fucking idiot! <laughs> it, it, it doesn't already. matter. Not right now. I would side with Maverick. I'm alright. And that Reza shot him. Yeah. I don't think it really matters, but just to be safe. Yeah, but you're the flyer on Dudu. You probably won't find him now. Not here in the darkness, at any rate. Well, that's just brilliant. What do you think, Chief? Berea, can you walk? Yeah, I think so. Alright, Sebastian, take Faria to the apartment and get us some help here from Maverick. Then we'll look for Reza. Right on! Come, Faria, I'll help you up. Everyone's got the same voices now? Ah, uh, they're just a little bit distinguishable. It's because you haven't spent enough time with them. Everyone sounds the same. <laughs> everyone, everyone sounds the same. There's only one person doing all the fucking voices here. Always has been. It's not too bad. Still entertaining. Oddly enough, I'm much better at doing female voices. I heard your explanation about that. You have like two male voices and like seven female voices. Did Bryce, the chief of police, take it upon himself to escort me today? Oh, it's you again. Are you surprised? No, but I guess it'll mean bad news. Right, so, how are you holding up? Better than yesterday, that's for sure. Let's go for a walk then, shall we? Sure. Okay, you want to see how fast it goes if you actually hold the skip button, not pressing the skip button? It's the same speed. It's just, you have to hold it. See? It's like skipping a little bit of time until it gets to one of these. I am unsure of what to pick here. <laughs> Well, as long as you don't pick where where I came from, this is attack on a diplomat. You know, just don't pick that one. It's first or last. And you've already done that, right? No, but I don't want to. Not right now. <laughs> Not on, on here, because it just takes too long. Alright, go ahead. That, that's going to be something I'm going to do in my off time. Alright. And what we're talking about, you just, just you, you decline like 99 times, and you get a cheap and get! There's still one achievement. I'm not even sure what triggers it. I just keep triggering it every time I, I do the whole new game and all. But I don't remember what triggers it. I'm just missing something. I don't know. Just so easy to get. Blah, 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 blah. It's a dragon all cut up. Kind of like how Anna will be. <laughs> or has been. I guess so. What was his name? At least Cancer won't be claiming her this time. Yeah. I mean, seriously, fuck the crabs. Ah. See what I did there? Crabs? Cancer? Huh? Oh. Yeah, the constellation Cancer. So, 
you didn't even know that I was a cancer. And how dare you? I'm, I'm upset. I'm upset. <laughs> He's definitely dead. Oh, yeah, state the obvious, man. That was suicide! <laughs> No, he's faking it. This is to train new guys on the force. What are these wounds telling you? It was suicide. <laughs> it was he was already dead. Suicide. It was a spastic suicide. Well, let's go ahead and just go go uh, for a perfect run just to get it quickly done. I don't know, don't the investigations affect how you work with Bryce? Actually, Bryce, yes, die. they do. I know. You have to do good enough, which means I think you have to get uh, the majority correct. Without doing too many extras. You didn't want to make any noise. No noise! His what? neck was the fatal wound! I see blood! Suggest that he had AIDS! <laughs> oh, what? <laughs> Go ahead and click yeah, it. That's... It won't affect it, really. There isn't blood. <laughs> I, I I I've always wanted to pick that that fucking answer. You could do the AIDS one and the other one, and it won't really matter too much. There isn't blood. You sure? Sniff, sniff. No, it's blood, all right. <laughs> yeah, he smells it. He smells it. it smells like blood. At least he doesn't wow. lick it. <laughs> He had AIDS! Nah, he died here. Okay. They don't even know what AIDS is. <laughs> what about the blood on his muzzle? He's a vampire. He had a bloody steak earlier. He's a vampire. Totally. <laughs> That's why he fought back, is because he wanted blood! Don't be silly. <laughs> he fought back. <laughs> That wasn't actually too bad. As long as you get that response, then you're good. As far as, you know, the investigations and whatnot go. Oh, it's the human! Go away. <laughs> well, I'm a human. Well, I call you by your name, but you never actually told me it. It's Faria. Hey, what are you doing here? Do you work for our police now? No, it's just a hobby. Oh, you! Yeah. <laughs> she likes that. By the way, didn't know you also did deliveries. I do a little bit of everything, really. That's nice. I liked my coffee yesterday. If you like it, why don't you take our number? We can deliver something to you next time if you don't want to come in. Thanks. <coughs> and Sebastian's impatient. I guess you can say Sebastian has a short fuse. Ah. Uh... Fucking racking it up Why? there today. All the bad puns. We got violent. He's the no way, Chris. Tell me. I find it interesting. No way tells me anything. so set in his ways right now. He's so focused on the problem that Reza is doing crap. At least that means someone will find him, right? Hey, I don't mind if, if uh, Maverick finds Reza. Yeah, like, as long I'm... as he catches him on surprise, bites into his neck. Or crushes his skull. Like, if, 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 in, uh, if, like, it came to pass that Maverick found Reza and killed him, Maverick could be like, he just tried to attack me again. Yeah. <laughs> and we meet with Bryce. Yep. Because that's what we're doing. They we're doing Bryce today. 
We're doing Bryce. <laughs> yeah, that's what we're doing. We're doing Bryce. You know he loves it. <laughs> Once again, I found myself within the police department, which seemed oddly quiet for this time of day. Didn't take me long to spot Bryce in his office. Hey, Faria. What's up? Nothing much, but he told me to contact you if I could remember anything that might help with the investigation. That's right. What do you have for me? I'm not sure if it's worth mentioning, but I've known Reza for a couple years, so I know some things about his personality. Mm-hmm. I see. Well, that's actually more helpful than you might think. Mannerisms, habits, all kinds of things would be useful to add to his profile to get a better idea of him. You know, I'm just about done here for the day, but if you want to discuss it over a beer or something, I'd be more than happy. Just one? I'll take three! <laughs> no, just go with them. Let's or go. you could you could either say don't drink or go because you'll still get a chance to go. All right, let's go. <laughs> I'll take three. You're just still finding that one interesting. Here we are. Why not? You don't even know what the size of the beers are. Not too shabby, I have to admit. Why does your alma make and it- just in time for happy hour. Do you come here often? Sometimes. Always. All of a sudden, <laughs> now you're giving him a southern drawl. <laughs> yeah. Hey, you two. What can I bring you? Just the usual. Hmm. One generic beer for the chief of police, sure thing. How about you, Faria? You, how do you know my name? <laughs> Me you can too. choose one of the top two if you want. You can say nothing yet, and Bryce will just say, Come on! Try Noted. something! I'll be right back. It wasn't long before the waiter returned with a drinking bowl as, as wide as it was tall, filled to the brim with foam-topped dark amber liquid. Carefully, he set it down in front of Bryce, who didn't hesitate to take a big gulp. He brought, he brought one for me as well, provided in a glass that seemed more appropriate for my kind. There you go. Just call a me if you need anything. Bowl? Of course. What about bold? I said bowl. A bacon oh, bowl. Yeah. <laughs> Bryce gets a drinking bowl because he doesn't have proper hands. So which, mean, which means so he, he laps it up like a doggy. <laughs> <laughs> so what is it you wanted to tell me about Reza? There are a few things. I mean, they're probably not much, but anything might help, right? That's right. Anything unusual about him, anything that defines his character or stands out about him could help us. How about you tell me what you know about him? Well, the earliest memories I have were when we both went to the same school. We only shared a few classes, though, and a couple of friends. Overall, I'd say he was above average student. We didn't talk very often, but he was always very outspoken and never failed to speak up to make his opinions known. He was the kind of person I'd fully expect to become a politician one day, or at least an activist of some sort. That's the impression I got from him. He spoke a lot, but you could also expect him to act on his word. Of course, his nature caused him to clash with others, sometimes even including the school staff, though his genuine enthusiasm also garnered praise from them. He was quite a character. After we all graduated, I didn't hear anything about him for a long time. Only some years later, after we found the portal, I was surprised to find out he was the human who had been sent to your world. He had volunteered. It wasn't until I was already here that I actually met him again, however brief our interactions were. But then I already told you everything about what happened prior to the eventual scuffle with Maverick. There's only one thing that stands out to me about those events. In the restaurant, when he told me about the letter, he mentioned I would know how to read its secret message. I know he values the use of his own intellect, but when I received the letter later, he apparently fully expected me to remember a random chemistry class we had together years ago in order to see the message. I see. So you did not arrange this beforehand. Not at all. I had no idea. That is quite peculiar. I know. I still wonder what he would have told me if Maverick hadn't inter interfered when we met at the portal. We do as well. You can believe that. How was Maverick even allowed to intercept this letter and his letter and read it? He could have easily done so since he was in charge of Reza and everything, but he totally shouldn't have. I mean, we wouldn't want anything of the sort with you. We wouldn't ha we wouldn't do anything of the sort with you. Everything he has done in regards to Reza has been a poor show of character. 
I suppose so. In any case, thanks for telling me all this. You never know what kind of information, when this kind of information can be useful. No problem. Just when I thought an awkward silence might set in, Bryce spotted the waiter and doesn't, didn't hesitate to speak up. Hey, waiter, bring me another! I hadn't noticed, but while I was talking, Bryce had been busy sipping on his drink. The empty bowl before him was proof of his proficiency, while I had barely touched my own drink. Here you go. Bryce was just about to start on his second one, he suddenly spoke up. You know what? Why don't we have ourselves a drinking contest? Leave. <laughs> I would, but I don't think I could beat someone like you. I, I was honestly thinking about saying that. You could do that. It will. It'll. He'll it'll, still pressure you to have a drinking contest. How about a handicap then? I'll go easy on you. You're not letting this go, are you? Just having fun. <laughs> All right, let's do this. Bryce lowered his snout and gulped down beer at an inhuman rate, the bowl draining rapidly and was empty in an instant. Fair's fair. Considering they don't even have cars, at least I won't have to worry about drinking and driving. Yay! The rules are simple. We both get around, then we wait a few moments until the next one so the effects can kick in. Whoever gives up first loses. That's that your sounds mistake. easy enough. I never give up now. <laughs> <laughs> that sounds easy enough. Sure, just wait till you have a swig of the real stuff and we'll see how easy it is for you. <laughs> Alright, let's do this. He made a show of looking me in the eyes while he lowered his muzzle into the bowl before he started guzzling his drink noisily. It was gone in seconds. Certainly, this was going to be tough. My confidence faltered, but there was no turning back now. How did I think I could win a drinking contest against a frickin' dragon? Nevertheless, I grasped the drink, putting on the best show I could while trying to recreate Bryce's feet. After the first sip, however, I realized it was very different from any other beer I had tried before. Yet I persevered through the intense taste until the glass was empty. I probably w it probably wasn't as impressive as Bryce had been just moments earlier, but I couldn't afford to show any weakness. My plan was cut short though as I set down the glass and an unusual strong aftertaste hit me, causing me to make a face. <laughs> How'd you like it? <laughs> Ugh, this is some really strong stuff. I told you, you better know beforehand how much you can take or it'll hit you harder later on. Wanna give up already? Shut up! <laughs> Baka! <laughs> shut up! No, shut up, one of the two. <laughs> shut up! That brought out your fighting spirit, huh? I like that. So when's the next round starting? Soon enough. Do you feel it? Do you feel the buzz kicking in already? Err... Uh, don't lie to me. I can see it on your face. Unless that's blushing I see and not the alcohol. That's not blush! That's not a blush! <laughs> I'm sure it isn't. Anyways, how do you like it here so far? I mean, compared to whatever it is that you came from. I'm having a drinking contest with a dragon. How could I not love this? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> we'll see how much you like it when I've drunk you under the table. <laughs> Which apparently, I don't know. It's totally gonna happen. <laughs> totally. Waiter, bring us another round. Coming right up. Here you go, having ourselves a little contest, are we? You know how it goes. That I do. Be careful, Furry. He's a real pro. <laughs> you just added an extra word. <laughs> Did I hear something about a contest? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I, like when I first saw this guy, I imagined him to like have like a complete raspy tone, like like someone who's almost dying. Uh, yeah, you so something about the contest. <laughs> uh, but this is where Ziff comes in. Maybe. 
Yeah. Up to I'm your old shenanigans, I see. <laughs> now, don't spoil the fun. I don't go around telling people about what you're up to, either. Point taken. Enjoy. What are you up to? <laughs> of course, he wouldn't have challenged me if he wasn't confident he would win. Guess I'll just have to try my best. I went first last time, so it's your turn now. As I put the glass to my lips and started swallowing the dark amber liquid, I was struck by how much more difficult this round was compared to the first. One thing that always puzzled me about seasoned drinkers was the sheer amount of liquid they can ingest without issue. Keeping it down, however, was a much different question. But this contest wasn't about keeping it down. There, your Four frame turn. FPS. 35 FPS. Now back down to four. <laughs> I know, right? Did I see you struggling there for a second? <laughs> That's my tactic, to make you think I'm struggling so you'll let your guard down. Do it. Do it. A roaring laughter erupted from the dragon as paws <laughs> striking the table, rattling the containers resting on it. Keep it up, kiddo. You'll stand a chance if you can make me die of laughter. <laughs> don't die. Bryce, you're the one person I don't want to die in this run. <laughs> it's my turn. Let me demonstrate. It's for my turn. Let me demonstrate. I'll show you how it's all done. Mm. First, you take it out and you wiggle it. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> Okay! <laughs> I don't think we're there yet! <laughs> I'm just gonna quietly eat my RB sandwich. Once again, he consumed Once his again, drink. Once again, he consumed his drink. Oh, I was gonna read it for you. Though his you were, gonna eat. were noticeably slower than before, his resolve was also fading, though not as fast as mine had. As he clearly held the advantage, was there any way I could still turn this around? There. Now let me ask you a question. I know you want to tell me all this stuff about Reza, but was that the only reason you wanted to meet with me? Maybe having a little Maybe fun. Maybe having a little fun right? doesn't hurt, right? He totally does not like the second option. Thoughts. Friends in other places. Well, I won't disagree with that. Waiter, next round! <laughs> and after... Oh. Three rounds of Jose Cuervo. <laughs> I swear, we're not drunk. Coming. There you go. Thanks. How are you holding up? Just fine. Thanks for asking. If you say so, good luck. Was it your turn, or is it my turn? It's yours. Alright. By now, it was obvious that Bryce was faltering. Though he still was faring much better than I was, he even had to take a break in the middle of his beer, unable to down it in one go. Now, it's yours. He was a lot heavier than me, and even though his bowls held far more liquid than my glasses, how'd I think I stand a chance against him? When I picked up my glass, I didn't even have feeling in my fingers anymore. I had to pause a few times, but in the end I made it, though I wasn't sure how much more I could take. So, so, what do we do now? I also like how the fucking camera in the background's like shifting and moving because we're drunk. It's getting blurry as well. <laughs> Wait for you to uh, so throw up so I win. <laughs> you <laughs> wish. That was the rule. <laughs> you <You're> so... <laughs> wish. I can see that you're close. Just imagine. <laughs> Just a question of time now, Sonny. Oh. Can I That's ask even... you a question? Go ahead. <laughs> Why are Why you, you so, so damn, damn attractive? <laughs> I still love this, even I though just I've, I've just I nothing more to say about that. Even though I played through this multiple times, <laughs> I still love it. <laughs> Wait, our next round. <laughs> there you are. 
Blearily, the back. dragon looked at me, seemingly unable to focus. I could see he was hitting his limit, but so was I. Maybe if I just held out a little longer. Whose turn is it even? What do you think? <laughs> I'm thinking I don't even know anymore. <laughs> it's yours. <laughs> mine. You, do I really answer with mine? It doesn't really matter too much, but I just go ahead with mine, because it is yours. Fair enough. Mine. It's my turn. Good. At this point, I had difficulty picking up my glass, which I, I was about to give up, but I was sure if I held on one more round, it'd be over. I could still win this. I had to wait a few moments after each sip in order to continue, but I did not give up until eventually the glass was empty. Suck on this, you scaly bastard. No! Don't mean me now! Your move, Chief. <laughs> For the first time, I could see something in his eyes other than his always present confidence. Was it disbelief or insecurity? I guess my feet caught him off guard as he seemed genuinely impressed. If nothing else, this showed me that even his own conviction was cracking now. I could totally win this. You're cute. I like you, I really do, but I sure as heck am not going to let you win. He was struggling. It became, more, it became more and more obvious as he tried to swallow the liquid in his bowl bit by bit. He stopped at one point, panting heavily. I considered taking a cheap shot at him, but as he had refrained from doing so during my turn, I wasn't going to start now. There! I was getting tired. I could hear Bryce's voice, but I could not make out the inv individual words anymore. I decided to rest my eyes, just for a little bit. Thunk. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you okay? You fell down and you look kind of messed up. <laughs> if you think I'm giving up, you're I'm mistaken. Giving up, you're mistaken. This, this isn't is over. over. I can see that. Ready for another round, or do you give up? No, no, no. One of the last two. I know when I've had enough, and it's now. Because you just realized you fell over <laughs> after a moment. You're a well slow done, man. Kiddo. Didn't think you had it in you. You know, it was fun watching you and all, but you've both had enough for the evening. I think you'd better leave now, and after you've come out after you've come out from under the table, that is. Alright, I'll be going then. Wait a minute. What is it? Maybe you should go with him just to make sure he gets home safely and doesn't do anything stupid, you know? It's kind of an unspoken rule around here that whoever is his drinking buddy does so. When I looked over to him, I discovered Bryce had passed out for the moment. This could prove difficult. Fine. Fine. <laughs> reluctantly. <laughs> but not Go so on. reluctantly. Let's get you home. He is still unconscious. Slap him. Slap him. <laughs> Slap him. Why? Because it's funny. <laughs> Just Are you do it. sure this wake up! Wake up! Wake this, up! The w matter the way you wake him up here doesn't really matter. What? Is that you, Faria? <laughs> Stop it! I'm awake already. <laughs> <laughs> slap him again. <laughs> yeah. If you were to hear the sound, you could hear you're still slapping him <laughs> until he said stop. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Where am I? Still in the bar. Ugh. Come on, let's get you home, you big wuss. <laughs> <clears throat> I awoke looking at an unfamiliar ceiling. For a moment, I wondered where I was before the events of last night all came back to me. <clears throat> You're As just I got up and looked dragon. around, I realized that I had apparently slept on the floor. Where am I? This isn't my apartment. No. He's drooling. Guess I must have <laughs> yep. passed out after I got Bryce home. Hey, Bryce. 
Just don't call him Fatty. Good morning, sunshine. <laughs> <laughs> the dragon moved and let out a groan before he opened his eyes. Damn, my head. Why are you even here? Guess I must have passed out after I escorted you home. Oh, right after our little game. Do you remember who won? I don't even know, but you stood your ground and I respect that. You didn't do anything funny while I was out, did you? <laughs> the dragon rose from the couch with a nice morning stretch, rubbed his eyes, then held his head high as he let out a grunt and a big yawn. Alright, you know what? I'm sorry. The whole contest thing was a stupid idea and I shouldn't have suggested it. Especially not to you. Well, it's not like you forced me to participate, so I suppose I share some of the blame. Let's just pretend the whole thing never happened. Deal. <laughs> Maybe I'll invite you over some other time and show you that there's more to the chief of police than getting drunk and passing out. But how are we going to find out who won if we aren't going to have a rematch? Yeah, I'm sure we'll think of something else that can measure our endurance. Giggity, giggity. <laughs> Is that the chief trying to make a pass at me? <laughs> Possibly. Uh, no, it doesn't really matter who you choose. You can hang out with anybody. Or just rest. How many times have you rested or skipped things? Over ten. Oh, so you've already gotten an achievement then? Yep. Okay. Chef du Lord, to you. No, I don't want to skip ahead. Another day, another morning. I woke from dreams filled with fire and smoke. Blah, blah, blah. Stuff that we already know. Blah, 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 blah. Blah, 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 blah. It's the chief! Hey, Bryce. Isn't it a little early for a rematch? <laughs> I'd agree with you, but that's not why I'm here. Today's agenda isn't nearly as exciting or fun. Well, what is it? Do some good old-fashioned police work. We're counting on your help again. Sure. Sure. Sign me up. Great. We'll take the list of places Reza visited his days before he vanished. We'll check those out. Maybe find a lead. He might help us understand his motivations or give us some context to his actions. I can certainly try. That's all you have to do. That's reassuring. Are you ready to go? Sure. Let's go. There's a couple of places we can check out. Let's see where we should go first. While Bryce focused on his list, I saw someone approach out of the corner of my eye. A closer look revealed it was Sebastian, waving his arm in an attempt to get our attention as he ran towards us. His face grave. We'll continue with this next time, boys and girls. If you like this video, give it a big thumbs up or a like, whichever you prefer to call it. And subscribe if you had not for more content. I will see you guys in the next episode. These guys will probably still be here. No! No! Go! No. <laughs> Alright.